The more regulation there is for crypto, the better it is for Coinbase. Brian Armstrong, the CEO of Coinbase, made this statement on the 9th of August during an earnings call. He also said the company is eager to see common sense frameworks for regulation next year within the United States. On the 9th of August, hackers stole approximately $570,000 from a DeFi platform called Curve Finance. The news first broke on Twitter, where users shared screenshots of the problem. Later that day, the platform's operators announced on their official Telegram page that they had resolved the issue, but advised the protocol's users not to use Curve.Fi or Curve.Exchange until they can locate the source of the exploit. Ripple Labs' head of DeFi markets made a statement saying, so I think institutional adoption is where it's going and the institutions are what is going to enable that killer app for consumers to really bring crypto and DeFi to the next level. He made this statement on the 9th of August at the Blockchain Futurist conference titled The Future of Decentralized Finance. He talked about the fact that centralized financial platforms need to come in and simplify the DeFi experience for everyday users to boost DeFi adoption. Hackers have stolen $1.4 billion dollars this year using crypto bridges. Coinbase's revenue has plummeted 61% in the latest quarter. This is a 1.1 billion dollar loss. The amount of decentralized apps on Polygon has hit 37,000. This is a 400% increase this year.